Hello and welcome to my video, Keep Psalms and Carry On, Seeking Solace in the Psalms. In this video series, I offer you a psalm to focus on and to enjoy this psalm to help you bring peace and meditation into your own Christian walk. I offer this video not so much to explain the psalm, but to enjoy it as a tool of meditation to help you to find your own calm and peace in God's word. Psalms are wonderful to meditate upon, to recite over and over, to strengthen us as Christians. So let's begin with a prayer. Our Lord and Father, we thank you for the many blessings you bestow upon us. Bless us now with clarity, with strength of mind. Bless us with serenity, and the capacity to know you and feel your presence in us. Be with us now as we meditate upon your word. It is in your son's most holy name that I pray. Amen. All right, so the psalm that I would like to offer you today is Psalm 19. It's a rather lengthy one, but there's a, so much good in that that you can meditate upon by reading it. So. We're going to look at some of the verses and read them and see how they can help us with our own meditations. So read the beginning of this psalm. The heavens declare the glory of God and the firmament shows his handiwork. What a good way to remind yourself of the greatness of God. All you need to do is look to the heavens at the stars and planets up there. Look at his handiwork in the firmament, in the very earth, this, in the beauty of nature. And it goes on, day unto day, night unto night. Listen how that sounds when you repeat it. Day unto day utters speech, and night unto night reveals knowledge. His speech... His voice is heard all around you, everywhere, in everything you see and hear in nature. His voice, his words, cut through the earth to the end of the world. There is such good imagery here. Look further. In them he has set a tabernacle for the sun. The tabernacle in ancient times was the inner chamber that held the most holy relics, the place where God resided, they felt. What an image for the sunrise. He likens it to the bridegroom coming out of his chamber, each day coming out, a strong man ready to run his race, ready for this beginning of this new adventure. This is a wonderful thought to use to begin your day. The sun going across the heavens each day. And then we have these parallels. Look in the second column. The law of the Lord is perfect, converting the soul. The testimony of the Lord is sure, making the wise simple. The statutes of the Lord are right, rejoicing the heart. The commandment of the Lord is pure, enlightening the eyes. The fear of the Lord is clean, enduring forever. The judgments of the Lord are true and righteous altogether. Parallels have an almost chanting quality. They stick in our memories and hold great force. And at the end, the judgments keep them, desire them, because the reward is valuable and sweet. Is that the way we normally think of judgments? Think of that. Judgments usually seem to be, you know, some legal uh, that we don't there. But how can judgments be sweeter than honey, be finer than gold? Well, here's your answer. And he answers in a rhetorical question. Who can understand his errors? Can we truly understand our errors? Do we know ourselves as we think we do? We need this humility, this understanding that we don't know all of our secret faults. 
we look to the Lord, the Lord of all heavens and the firmament around us, to not let our sins rule us. And we finish with a prayer here in this psalm to let our words speak, the meditation in our heart be accepted by God. What a full psalm to meditate upon, to bring us closer to him. If you enjoyed my video, please consider hitting the like button, the thumbs up at the bottom. Also, if you're not a subscriber, check out the Northfield Church of Christ YouTube page, and you'll see live streams of our Sunday morning services, our Sunday morning Bible studies, and even a Sunday evening service that's offered in addition by our minister, Mark, on YouTube at 6 p.m. on Sundays or any time that you wish to listen to it. And he'll sing more songs, offer you the Lord's Supper, and present another lesson for you to be rich in your Christian life. So, until next video, keep Psalms and carry on.